Hey. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Okay. I'll talk the <laughs> I'm gonna guess that sounds. Hello everybody, my name is Power Dragon. Yes, and oh hello. Door. <laughs> Alright, cool. Uh, and we, last time on Undertale, we went, uh, Underline had a letter for us to deliver to Alphys, which turned out to be a letter for a, a love letter of some sort, which Alphys thought we wrote. So, we went on a date with Alphys at a garbage dump, of all places, and then Undyne came and it got a bit weird. So, yeah. Uh, and Papyrus asked us to check on Dr. Alphys. So, yeah, that's why we're at the lab, still watching us. Cool, cool, cool. The fridge is full of instant noodles and soda. Uh, hello? Anybody here? No, just black wall. Okay. Uh, oh, hello, what's this? It's a note from Alphys. Read it. Uh, yes. It's hard to read because of the handwriting. But you try your best. <laughs> hey, thanks for your help back there. You guys, your support really means a lot to me. But, as difficult as it is to say this, you guys alone can't magically make my own problems go away. I want to be I want to be a better person. I don't want to be afraid anymore. And for that to happen, I have to be able to face my own mistakes. I'm going to start doing that now. I want to be clear. This isn't anyone else's problem but mine. But if you don't ever hear from me again, if you want to know the truth, enter the door to the north of this note. You all at least deserve to know what I did. That's all she wrote. What did she do? Let's go find out, I guess. Alright, going down the elevator. What? Warning, warning. What? Elevator losing power. No. M. Tether stability loss. What the fuck is that? Altitude dropping. No! <laughs> oh, that's the end of the adventure. Thanks for watching, guys. That's been Undertale. Uh, I plan. Uh, I don't know when we'll come back to this, but. Oh, we're not dead. Uh, never mind. Cut that out. Cut that out. <laughs> uh, yeah, anyway. What? This place is spooky! Oh, hello. Entry number one. This is it. Time to do what the king has asked me to do. I will create the power to free us all. I will unleash the power of the soul. <laughs> Entry number two. The barrier is locked by soul power. Unfortunately, this power cannot be recreated artificially. Soul power can only be derived from what was once living. So, to create more, we will have to use what we have now. The souls of monsters. What has been going on down here? Entry number three. But extracting a soul from a living monster would require incredible power. Besides from... Besides being impractical, doing so would instantly destroy the soul's host. And unlike the persistent souls of humans, the souls of most monsters disappear immediately upon death. If only I could make a monster's soul last. What the fuck? Entry number five. I've done it. Using the blueprints, I've extracted it from the human souls. I believe this is what gives their souls the strength to persist after death. The will to keep living, the resolve to change fate. Let's call this power... Determination? So, monsters don't have any determination. They're missing out. Alright, we'll just... The true laboratory. What's this? Oh, hang on. There's a note on the ground. You can't make it all out. Elevator, lost power, enter the center door. That's all you could read. Huh. Power room. We can't go in there now. Buy chips. Uh, no. Actually, what, what do you got on it? I haven't... Okay, we've got, we got a lot. Like, oh my god. Uh, can we call anyone? Uh... Dimensional Papyrus and Undyne. There's no response. Oh, of course there's not. So we can't call for them for help. Uh hello. Entry number six. Asgore asked everyone outside the city for monsters that had fallen 
down. Monsters that had fallen down. The bodies came in today, they're still comatose, and soon they'll all turn into dust. But what happens if I inject determination into them? If their souls persist after they perish, then freedom might be closer than we all thought. Uh, were they trying to make determination? Entry number nine. Things aren't going well. None of the bodies have turned into dust, so I can't get the souls. I told the families that I would give them the dust back for the funerals. People are starting to ask me what's happening. What do I do? So, what was going on here didn't work right. Oh, are these. Oh, it's some kind of operating. Oh, it's stick. Ugh. You turned on the sink. We could turn it off, you know, global warming. Uh, hello. It's some kind of switch. There's a red colored slot in the center. What's this? There's another going to kind of get on. Drain. Dropped it. That's all you could read. Drain. Drain? Drain? Sink drains? Oh, what the hell? Is that milk? <gasps> yeah, we can have a drink. That's not milk. Oh, what the hell? Ha what? Blank draw drew near. A, B, and C. Oh, shit. I don't want to do this. No. I didn't want to do this. No. I didn't. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I didn't want to do this. Ow. I didn't want to do that. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. It's been a while. <laughs> Item sells... What? Item? The enemy put a piece of itself in your inventory? The hell? Ow. Ow. Oh, God. Stop. We want dial up all of a sudden? I don't. Cell? You take out your cell phone. You can hear voices through the receiver. Come join the fun! What? No! I don't. No. I think you guys are having. Okay. <laughs> Our fate rests upon you. Jeff, stay determined. Wow, okay then. Um, right. So that happened. Uh, be back. <laughs> Alright, here we go. So, we gotta use our cell phone. Come join the fun. I don't like these guys. Oh god, no. Now! Smells like batteries. Memory head. Uh, can I, shall I, do I join? Let's join the fun! You'll be with us shortly. No, I don't want to be with you shortly. Ow. Then hold still. No, I don't want to hold still. Have I got to refuse them? Oh god. Nobody can refuse. Be seeing you. Oh, they've just gone. Oh, that seems like it doesn't care anymore. Yay! What's that? There's a red key. You took it and put it on your keychain. Wait, there's a red slot thing here, right? So. Oh, there we go! Alright, hang on. Let's. Up. There we go. Alright. And then we'll just head on back to the room. Oh, look, the red thing's glowing. So we've got three more to do. Let's just save real quick. Okay, we read that one, didn't we? Yeah. What if we. It's a fake plant. Oh. Looks kind of dead for a fake plant. Alright. Entry number 12. These are horrible. Nothing is happening. I don't know what to do. I'll just keep injecting everything with determination. I want this to work. Entry number 13. One of the bodies opened its eyes. 
Okay, what's this? It's an empty dog food bowl. Seems like a comfortable bed. Lie on it? Uh, yeah, alright. Cool, we'll lie on it. Ah, nice and comfy. Ah, I'm just gonna get... What the? Hello. What are you... Oh. What? Oi. Hey. Don't let... I'll call the police. Put that thing away. Oh, okay, it's not what I thought it was. Did I just get petted by some sort of ghost? Okay then. Someone's under the seat. Check it out. Yeah. Oh, hello. It's a yellow key. Oh. What if? It, no. That one seemed a bit odd because it was kind of it was different from the others. Uh. The clock is broken. Ah. Uh -uh. Anyway. Entry number fourteen. Everyone that had fallen down has woken up. They're all waking around and talking like nothing is wrong. I thought they were goners. So did the termination do something to them? Golden flowers. Just like flowery. Entry number seven. Oh, hello. We'll need a vessel to wield the monster's souls when the time comes. After all, a monster cannot absorb the souls of another monster. Just as a human cannot absorb a human soul. So then, what about something that's neither human nor monster? What? Entry number 10. Experiments on the vessels are a failure. It doesn't seem to be any different from the control cases. Whatever. They're a hassle to work with anyway. The seeds just stick to you. I won't let go. Did it on plants? Is that what? What? Oh, what? <laughs> oh, speech bubble betrayed us! No, speech bubble, why? Oh my god. God. No, not fight. God damn. Uh, oh. Uh. Mystify. <laughs> it recognizes it has more to learn from this world. Receive the real last look. Oh, hello. What are you? What are you doing? What What are you doing? Oh my God! What the hell's going on there? Uh. Hum. Let's hum. You hum a familiar tune, but no one heard you. Ah. Sephiroth me. Oh my god. Stupid butterflies. Uh, pray. You kneel and pray for safety. Thing, re comma, remembers it's conscious. Oh my god, what the... Oh god. Oh god. Oh! Ooh! Ooh! Clean? You wash your hands. Nothing happened. Hey! I've got no germs on my hands now. Oh god. Oh, what, the, what, the, what the- Ow! I don't know. Go away, butterflies. Butterflies. No! We've got to do everything? I don't want to pick on it. That's mean. You pick on Reaper Bird. Reaper Bird seems to remember something. Someone finally gets it! Courage! Ribbit, ribbit! Oh god. <laughs> Not the heads again! Not the heads again! <laughs> Not the heads. Reaper Bird seems. Plac. Place it? Plac it? Ah, frickin'. Okay, bye! Hmm. Oh, we haven't got the blue. What's this? There's no. You can't make it on. Cold. That's all you can- <laughs> Just the word cold. Really? Okay. Hey, gorgeous! How you doing? I'm doing good! Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that was. So, read those. So, did Alphys- I'm assuming it's Alphys that was doing this since she's a doctor and all. She put determination into the plants? Did anyone else just see that bed move? Okay, watch the, watch the bed. Watch the bed. Uh, let's just heal up again real quick. Just probably wait until I'm a bit lower on health. 
Yeah, you know, I'll do. I'll do that for next time. I'll wait a bit until I'm a bit lower. Uh, three. And anyway, number fifteen. Seems like this research was a dead end, but at least we got a happy ending out of it. I sent the souls and the vessel back to Asgore, and I called all of the families and told them everyone's alive. I'll send everyone back tomorrow. Smiley face. Yay! Everyone gets to go home. Entry number sixteen. No, 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 no. So something happened. What the? Uh. Okay then. We'll never speak of this again. All right, moving on. What is this? Oh, now even the save points aren't safe. Smells like sweet lemons. Lemon bread. Uh, let's unhug it. You let lemon bread be. Lemon bread's teeth shake. Welcome to my special hell. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, d oh, d oh what the f- what the, uh, Don't eat me. What the hell? Flex. You flex your arm, lemon bread's muscles shake. That's what they all say. Don't eat me! Well, they all say don't eat me, because, like, I. Ow! That was my own fault. I went into the teeth. Uh. Hum. You hum a familiar tune. Lemon bread seems to remember something. I felt this before. Oh my god! Okay, ow! Ow! Could this be a goodbye? Yep, it's goodbye. Say! Okay, now I think a good time to heal up now. God damn, I'm gonna have to get more. Okay, there's another reedy thing. DT extraction machine. Status inactive. DT? Determination? This thing extracts determination? It's a bit foggy in there. I've read you already! Hey! Not on the ground, under sheets. Oh, yeah, we've we already got this one. Right, we'll look at those in a second. Entry number four. I've been researching humans to see if I can find any info about their souls. I ended up snooping around the castle. I found these weird tapes. I don't feel like Asgore's watched them. I don't think he should. Why not? There's a VHS player with a few tapes picked out beside it. They seem to be labelled in a specific order. Would you watch one? Uh, watch tape one. Here we go. Psst, Gory, wake up. Hmm. What is it, dear? Uh, and why do you have that video camera? Shush. I want to get your reaction. I think someone's making a special tape. What? I mean, no. <laughs> Gory, dearest. What is my favorite vegetable? Um, carrots, right? No, 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 no. My favorite vegetable is Edda, Mom, get out. What is this, Toriel? Toriel and Asgore. Go back to bed, dear. No, no, not yet. He. <laughs> now, if I were a dog, what breed of dog would I be? Uh. Hmm. I don't know, honey. What kind of dog would you be? I would be a Momoranian. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You sure are excited to have this child. You know, if you keep making jokes like this, one day you could be a famous Momoranian. <laughs> well, I am going to bed. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey, come on, Tori. Tori, yeah, Toriel. That one was funny. <laughs> I know. I'm just teasing you. Good night, dear. Good night, honey. Oh dear. Perhaps it is too dark in here for the video to come out. Well, that's convenient. Right, let's continue watching the tapes. Okay, Jeff, are you ready? Do your creepy face. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait. I had the lens cap off. Of course you did. What? You're not gonna do it again? Come on. Quit tricking me. 
<laughs> Who is... Wait, I'm Jeff. Aren't I? But... Who is that other guy? Who is the other one talking? Who is talking to Jeff? <laughs> howdy! J howdy? Smile for the camera! Howdy? Wait, howdy? Flowey? Ha! <laughs> this time I got you! I left the lip. I left the cap on. On purpose! Now you're smiling for no reason. Hehehe! <laughs> what? Oh, yeah, I remember. When we tried to make butterscotch pie for Dad, right? The recipe asked for cups of butter. But we accidentally put in buttercups instead. <laughs> yeah, those flowers got him really s- Aww. It felt so bad. We made Mom really upset. I should have laughed it off, like you did. Um, anyway, where are you going with this? Huh? Turn off the camera? Okay. What is go Stop looking towards the cap- the- me thing. Take number four. Anyway, let's carry on. I- I don't like this idea, Jeff. What? What? No, no, I'm not- Big kids don't cry. Yeah, you're right. No, I'd never doubt you, Jeff. Never. Y yeah we'll be strong. We'll free everyone. I'll go get the flowers. I'll go get the flowers? What is it with this game of bloody flowers? Jeff, can you hear me? We want we want you to wake up. Jeff, you have to stay determined. You can't give up. You are the future of humans and monsters. Psst, Jeff, please, wake up. I don't like this plan anymore. I... I... No, I said... I said I'd never doubt you. Six, right? We just have to get six. And we'll do it together, right? Six? Six what? Souls? I'm... Conf... Six more. His soul... Plus six more would be seven. So, so is that guy the first soul? Oh, hello. Click. The green key fits perfectly into the slot. Hey! <laughs> Thought there'd be something in here. Oh god. I can't. Okay, there we go. Anything. Too dark to see near the walls. Oh. Just keep to the wall and we'll be fine. Too close. Okay, there we go. What is going on in this place? What were those tapes? They must have been from like years ago or something. Okay, we've been in. I don't. This is getting deep now. I like it. Makes you think. Uh, oh, hello. What's this? Engine number 11. Now that Metaton's made it big, he never talks to me anymore. Except to ask when I'm going to finish his body. But I'm afraid if I finish his body, he won't need me anymore. Then we'll never be friends ever again. Not to mention, every time I try to work on it, I just get really sweaty. Okay. There's a switch on the wall. Press it. Hell yeah! Uh, what? It's a ball! Oh god, that's not a ball! Why does it have... Eh, eh, eh... Eh, eh, Okay, I can't sneak past it down. It's, it's the... Amalgamite. Amalgamate. Uh... You know, you know, screw you, I'm ignoring you. You try looking away, but it seems to appear everywhere you look. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the? Ah! No, 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 no! What the hell? Beckon. You call the amalgamate. But it bounds towards you, flecking a strange liquid from an orifice. Ew. Oh my god, what the hell? Go away! Shoo! Be gone with you! May the power of Christ compel you. You pet the magwite, it convulses rapidly, then calms down. It rests quietly on your lap for a moment. 
Suddenly, it shoots away and crawls wildly on the walls. What is this thing? Stop shooting arrows at me. Ow. This music is so creepy. You throw your weapon into the corner of the room. The amalgamite mate brings it back to you. Proudly? <laughs> you repeat this process a few times. The amalgamite is very tired. It leans lean its dripping amorphous body on you. Ah! Too close! Too Ow! Ow! No! Don't kill me! No! Margaret is switching affectionately. Can I... Oh god. Let's... Pet it? It starts to generate a stage one happiness froth. Go away! No! If I get him one more time... Me! <laughs> right, let's do this. So we've got to keep making it happy, I think. And make it keep shaking. From what I can gather. So then if we pet it... Yeah, because it keeps on shaking, so... I can only assume... Wait, go away. Ow. Oh, God. Then we... But your hand passes through it. It must not want to be pet for now. Oh, man. So we've got to keep doing different things, I guess. Can't just keep doing the same thing over and over. That's... Eh, it makes sense. Play. I'm just skipping the text. We've already read it before. So, go away. Please, go away. Leave me alone, you weird thing. Nothing else happens. God, stop firing arrows at me. Cut that. What, 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 what even are these? I don't even know. The, the, the music, if you want to call it that, is kind of getting faster too. Just like that thing. Go away. Seems too tired to play. God damn, what do you want me to do? You want me to play with you again? Is that what you want? You want me to beckon you? Like, what? Just get... Oh god, you've had to decipher. Are those cats? The argument seems to be... Those are cats. Those are weird looking cats. You won! Yay! Jesus Christ. That was probably one of the weirdest fights I've ever had. Well, no. The flowey fight from a couple episodes ago was pretty weird. I mean, can't get any weirder than that, right? Anyway, <laughs> so anyway, I think there are more. Sc ah, hello. Entry number nineteen. The families keep calling me to ask when everyone is coming home. What am I supposed to say? I don't even answer the phone anymore. Entry number twenty. As girl left me five messages today. Four about everyone being angry. One about this cute teacup he found that looks like me. Thanks, Asgore. We'll check that out in a second. Entry number 21. Sh God, stop shaking. I spent all my time at the garbage dump now. It's my element. It's empty. That gave me a little fright, not gonna lie. It's so cold. Let's make a joke. He told about pun. Her expression starts to shift. <laughs> I remember. The music's so sad. <laughs> Thank you. The music's so sad. Aww, I feel sorry for this thing. You won. <gasps> Blue Wait, what? Seems to contain samples of some kind. What? Why are you shaking? This thing is not empty. Why is this shaking? Check the 
every side of it. It's, it's shaking, but it's empty. I don't... Okay. So, where's the last slot? Okay, it's not in there. It's not in... No, it's not in there. Where haven't we been? Uh, let's try... We've been down here? Yeah, we've been... Wait. Oh, no. There was... A thing? Was there? Room... Is this where the blue one... Aha! Blue key fits perfectly. Nice! Right, so now the elevator should be working. Hey, handsome! Anyway. Let's go back to the elevator. This place is weird. So, Alphys has been conducting some kind of experiment on monsters to fill them with determination to get more souls. But something went wrong. Let's just quickly save. Okay, here we go. What's through here? Seems to be turned off. Seems to be turned off. What is this place? What the? It seems like this controls the elevator's power. Turn it on? Yeah, of course. We want to get back out of here. Hello. Oh no. Um. Uh oh. This isn't looking good. Go away, marshmallow people! Hey, stop! Oh, Alphys, I got you guys some food, okay? Sorry about that. They kind of get sassy when they don't get fed on time. Um, anyways, the power went out, and I've been trying to turn it back on, but it seems like you were one step ahead of me. This was probably just a big inconvenience for you. But I appreciate you came here to back me up. As I said, I was afraid I might not come back. But that's not because of these guys or anything. I was just worried I would be too afraid to tell the truth. Then I might run away or do something cowardly. Uh, I, I suppose I owe you an explanation. Yeah, as you probably know, Asgore asked me to study the nature of souls. During my research, I isolated the power I called determination. I injected it into dying monsters so their souls would last after death. But the experiment failed. Uh, clearly. You see, unlike humans, monsters' bodies don't have enough physical matter to take those concentrations of determination. Oh, so they can't handle it. Okay. Their bodies started to melt and lost what physicality they had. Pretty soon, all the test subjects had melted together into those. Seeing them like this, I knew I couldn't tell their families about it. I couldn't tell anyone about it, no matter how much everyone was asking me, and I was too afraid to do any more work, knowing everything I'd done so far had been such a horrible failure. But now, now I've changed my mind about all this. I'm going to tell everyone what I've done. It's going to be hard, being honest, believing in myself, but I'm sure there will be times where I'll struggle. I'm sure there will be times where I screw up again. Ah, oh, everyone screws up. But knowing, deep down, that I have friends to fall back on, I know it'll be a lot easier to stand on my own. Thank you. Come on, guys. It's time for everyone to go home. Aww. Wow. This... They've done some horrible stuff down here to people. It's a smiley face. Inch number eight. I've chosen a candidate. I haven't told Asgore yet, because I want to surprise him with it. In the center of his garden, there's something special. The first golden flower that grew before all the others. The flower from the outside world. It appeared just before the queen left. I wonder what happens when something without a soul gains the will to live. It has to be flowery. Inch number 18. The flower's gone. It has to be flowery! Oh, hello. It's a voice you have never heard before. Jeff, are you there? It's been a long time, hasn't it? 
but you've done well. Thanks to you, everything has fallen into place. Jeff, see you soon. What the hell? See you soon? Who was that? Wait, where are we? Wait, this is... Oh my god, we're back at the palace. But why are we back here all of a sudden? I don't understand. What's going on? Have we got to go see Asgore again? Is there a safe point anywhere? Be nice. <laughs> okay, the birds are still here. Hello, save point. Aha, there we go. Oh, no. The end. Again. Uh, okay, let's go. Hey, birdie! This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. I don't think we can. I think I think we're good. I see. This is it then. Ready? A light a strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination once again. Human, it was nice to meet you. Goodbye. <laughs>